Hey everybody, welcome to Living Lux on Half the Bucks. Do you like my friend here? Who's ready for Valentine's Day? My friend here can't raise a hand, but he has kind of a, it's, I don't know. I didn't attend on this having a face, but it ha looks like it does have a face. Um, this is the Valentine's Day theme heart shape punch box. Tell me what you guys think in the comments below. Does it look a little spooky? Does it look like a face? Or do you just think it's so totally cute? So I'm going to show you how to make this. Now, I know somebody out there is um, somebody out there. You're looking for something fun to do with your kids or you're just looking for an a fun, creative activity. Um, this is definitely a fun activity, super fast. It did take me a few hours. Um, but that's with taking a lot of breaks, but it's a super easy craft project. Didn't actually probably it cost you next to nothing, probably at the most, maybe $5 because the majority of the supplies, sometimes you may already have in your house. And I just used, I have a lot of crafting supplies, so I just use whatever I have. So um, I got a great response last time when I did the last punch box. So I wanted to do another one again. I want to do part two want to do part two so that way y'all can y'all can punch something out oh wait i think something has a little but y'all go you could your kids can go bam 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 just punch out the eyes and then get the treats in there you know no need in developing a, a valentine's day basket a bag or anything like that just give them this punch back so they can let off some steam and just go at it you know what I'm saying? Just go, just let them go wild. They cooped up in the house anyway. Just give them a whole bunch of punch boxes so they can just go pam, pam, pam. Okay, I'm gonna calm down. But anyways, that's why I wanted to do this because I wanted my kids to have a little bit more fun, a little bit more interactive than just the normal Valentine's Day gift basket or bag or anything like that. And you guys had a great, I had great response on the last one. So this is what I'm here for, a heart-shaped one. Uh, the tools you're going to need, and I'm going to put it in the comments below, but pencil, ruler, uh, tissue paper, definitely going to need some tissue paper. Get knock this out. Um, tape, scissors. I'm looking at a list here. So if I look down, don't mind me. Uh, hot glue gun, hot glue gun sticks, boxes. I use USPS, those free boxes. I got a boatload of them uh, because I ordered too many but I bought the shoebox style one. So that's totally free. You just gotta wait for them to give it to you. So I don't know how long that'll take. That's a different topic, postal service delay. We're not gonna talk about that, but they are free. So, um, and then you wanna get something, whatever you're gonna use for your covering of this. I use streaming paper. I only used one roll, but however, I didn't do the back but I still have some left over that I have enough to do the bat. But um, I use streaming paper for all of this. You can paint if you want to paint over it. Um, you find that easier to paint or if you want to use wrapping paper or even tissue paper, that's up to you. Um, and don't forget your toys, your little treats, surprises, money, whatever you want to put inside so your kids can knock this out and get some treats as well. And all of the supplies is optional, so whatever works for you, then um, definitely go for it. If you try something different, let me know in the comments below. But um, if you like this video, uh, please give me a thumbs up, a comment, subscribe. I definitely want to do more crafting things like this. I have other things planned in mind. So, you know, if you have any ideas, the things that you want to see me do, then let me know in the comments as well. Um, and let's see and let's keep in touch also so i will put my instagram because that's mostly where i'm at is um you can find me on instagram and i'll put that down below and also um in the comments as well so i thank you so much guys for watching um i greatly appreciate the responses i had on the last punch box i did so i want to come at y'all and see what y'all think about a this one is a little bit more handheld and it's a heart shape. So let me know what you think. Thank you so much. And I will see you on my next one. Bye.
Now look at it and tell me if you be able to see. Look, look at it. Am I able to see it? Ha, 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 ha.